Hey guys, so it's a couple days before Christmas. Um, I wanted to read you a couple poems by Scott Emmons. They are Christmas poems. I figured, eh, why not lighten the mood? So I'm going to read you a couple poems. So here we go. Um, the mall at Christmas. The festive lights are twinkling. The sun of pine is thick. The tiny tots are lining up to visit old St. Nick. There's a tingling of sleigh bells as a chorus sweetly sings. And if you find a parking spot, an angel gets its wings. What was I thinking? I bought this ugly ornament. I don't know why, I must admit. I'll leave it in the box, I guess, because hanging's much too good for it. Seeing Santa. He looked like a peddler just opening his pack. And a lot of a lot like a plumber, as seen from the back. Christmas Conundrum I frequently find myself asking, though it's not like it keeps me awake, why Christmas gives so many people a neurotic compulsion to bake. Treats, glorious treats, candy canes and gingerbread, Christmas cookies green and red, roasted chestnuts, spicy cheese, pass the K.O. pectate, please. We wish you something, something. Here we come a caroling around the neighborhood. We haven't had a lot of time to practice like we should. We're jolly and we're merry and we sing like little birds. We sure would sound delightful if we'd only learn the words. Fond farewell. It's sad to see the day arrive for taking down the tree. We'd love to see it linger, but it isn't meant to be. Yet in a sense we never lose the friend we hold so dear. The needles in the carpet will be with us throughout the year. The tree and me. Oh, Christmas tree. Oh, Christmas tree. You stand so proud and tall. As I would do if I could keep my bad side to the wall. All I want for Christmas. The carolers are singing, Merry Christmas! Someone yells. The city streets are ringing with the clang of Christmas bells. Yes, everywhere the air is filled with sounds of joy and mirth. But all I want for Christmas is a little peace on earth. Merry Christmas. I've seen some frightful Christmas scenes. Ornaments in smithereens. Needles scattered wall to wall. Tinsel trailing down the hall. Angels fallen from their heights. Knotted up cords and shattered lights. Branches turn. Two mangled sticks, cats and Christmas trees don't mix. Hidden treasure. We got this lamp from Aunt Auntie Jane on Christmas long ago. It's sort of like a walrus head with lion's feet below. We never know just what to say when people ask, what is it? That's why we only bring it out when Auntie comes and visits. Greedy? Guess. The relatives like country ham, plus all the turkey they can get. They put away a leg of lamb they've barely started yet. They eat a heap of stuffing then, a pound or two or three or four, and then devour a Cornish hen, which leaves them wanting more. They scan the room with hungry eyes for cookies, cakes, and sugar plums. They stuff themselves with minced meat pies and lick up all the crumbs. They finish off with a half a ton of candy canes. They like the crunch. And when their Christmas breakfast's done, they sit and dream of lunch. Wish list. Dear Santa, toys get broken, candy's cheap, pets take effort, fruits won't keep, candles smell, clothes might clash. Games are broken, please bring cash. Love, Mindy. Pet peeve. I'd rather eat a reindeer hole or have my stocking stuffed with coal or perch upon a blazing log or drink an egg without the nog or skinny dip where Santa dwells than hear a dog sing jingle bells. Decorating for dummies. I hope you'll heed the good advice and not just try to wing it. I found it's best to pop the popcorn before you try to string it. Christmas magic. Someday I'll see a reindeer herd go soaring overhead. A gentle Christmas snow will fall, its shades of green and red. I'll see a snowman come to life and start to celebrate, and on the strange enchanted day, my tree will stand upright. 
homey holiday. I'll be home for Christmas. I go there every year. A place that's plain and peaceful with a cheery atmosphere, where winter skies are silvery and days are cold and sleety. I'll be home for Christmas, because I can't afford Tahiti. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, it is December 21st. I just wanted to wish you all happy holidays and Merry Christmas. And I hope you guys are doing great. Bye!